What is going on everybody man? I just wanted to make a video because I'm hyped bro. It finally comes back this Saturday slash Sunday. I believe it's going to maintain the same schedule as last time but I'm not entirely sure. But regardless man, let's go dude. It's finally time man for the awesome sauce to come back and we're getting the stuff that was skipped. Now I saw this PV uh, tr thing that aired in Japan on Twitter and from what I can tell, it appears that the Homeless arc is going to be the first one. Like, Homeless and Kakura Boyfriend are probably going to be like the first two arcs that, that get done. Regardless of what gets done first, or what happens, or the, the structure in which you're going to do it, I don't care, man. As long as it gets done. As long as it gets done, I'm in it like swimwear, man. I'm just so happy that Gintama's back, bro. I've missed the Gintama anime so much, especially this stuff. Like, with the serious stuff that's been going down in the manga for so long, to be able to get this breath of fresh air of, like, the old classic Gintama, man, and actually having, like, everyone to... Oh, it's gonna, it's gonna be amazing, bro. It's gonna be amazing, and at the same time, a little bit emotional, but it's it's also gonna be extremely awesome sauce, man, to relive a lot of the, a lot of, like, what made Gintama Gintama to me, man. And, you know, that's not to say that I'm not enjoying the, the current stuff in the manga. It's just that we've been getting, like, so much of the serious stuff back to back to back to back that in the anime, for it to give us this and for it to give us the, the, the like, some of the arcs and the way that Gintama used to do it, it's going to be a nice breath of fresh air, man, for me as a Gintama fan. And it's going to be awesome sauce, dude. Like, I really cannot wait, man. I can't wait to see the awesome new opening and ending and all the content that's going to be, uh, you know, that, that's going to happen. I know a lot of people, I know a lot of people who, who didn't read the uh, the skipped arcs. So there's going to be brand new content for a lot of people, man. And I, and I, I could definitely tell you guys uh, that you're going to be in for a treat, man. Because to me, Sirachi... At least from for, for, from my experience with the Gintama series going from you know the beginning up until whenever I initially caught up, the most fun that I had in my initial catch up experience to catch up to chapter five hundred and two was the from the four hundreds. And the four hundreds is what they're gonna animate here in the Porori arc. Like like we you guys saw a little bit of the four hundreds with the confession arc, the reunion arc the uh, the the the, re the reunion arc, the love potion, and the um, the stuff with Mutsu and Saka Goto, uh, for sure. Like those those you guys have seen, man. Uh, part of the four hundreds, but the other ones that were not done in the four hundreds is what you're about to see here in the four hundred arc. Like, I feel like Sirachi because he was about to enter, or he felt like the time was about to wind down for him to finally tell that story that we got in Shogun Assassination. I feel like that's why in the 400s we got like these arcs that were even more insane than usual for Gintama. And like you could really tell that his storytelling and the way that he was structuring his arcs and the comedy, it was just, and the gender bent arc was also in the 400s as well. Like all the stuff that I guess Sirachi wanted to do but never got around to doing beforehand, he just laid it all down on the table before Shogun Assassination. Like he, he, he gave us every ounce of creativity that he had in his brain and gave it to us back to 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 back in the 400s and like the 400s it's so much fun and that's why i'm so excited that's why I've, I've been excited for when the time would come that we would finally get the skipped arcs in the anime and it's finally gonna happen guys this sunday october 1st man it's gonna be one awesome sauce of a day um i don't think i work so i'm, I'm gonna be here i'm gonna be here regardless of whether it comes out on saturday or sunday i will be here talking about the awesome sauce man hopefully doing a reaction to the opening and the ending and then if which crunchy only they're gonna pick it up they're gonna pick it up so i'm not gonna be doing reactions this this time around though because I, I feel like with these specific episodes, I want to watch them alone and then come out of here and just talk about them afterwards in the same similar fashion that I did for Gintama, so, you know, pre-300. If you guys weren't around for the old for the old channel and the old King Recon channel where I did a lot of like the Gintama videos from, I started doing Gintama videos at, from episode 266 up until where it is currently. So for, for those of you that don't know the way that I used to do it, I used to just come on here, review, talk, and like do a discussion like after the episode for special episodes like Oil Rain, which is one of my favorite episodes in the entire series, and whatnot. Like I would break it down, you know, like 
it's soundtrack to, to like soundtrack voice acting uh favorite scenes even like pulling them up on here and like you know really go in depth with it, in depth with it man and it's something that i miss doing because it's something i don't get to do often when it comes to anime and with gintama since i know the story i know the content it's easier for me to do stuff something like that uh normally for the serious stuff i do like anime manga comparisons when it comes to the to 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 like the the stuff that that's and like in the 400s, like an oil rain, the feigned illness arc, uh, and that kind of stuff. I more like to sit down and discuss uh, why it is that this works so well, and like my favorite my favorite moments in the episodes, and you know, kind of like a review slash discussion, you know, in the in the, in the way that I, I like to do it for the episode. So I'll I'll be bringing that stuff back. If you guys were here for the old channel, you know what I'm talking about. I'll be I'll be bringing that that type of content back when it comes to the Gintama anime, uh, for for this for the Portori arc, which is gonna be fun, man. It's gonna be fun because I haven't done it in about two 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 and a half years. You know, not since we hit Shogun Assassination have I done a video like that. And plus, like, the old channel. That, that was all, like, on the old channel. So, we need new stuff for all the guys that just started watching here on the new channel. Uh, and the way that I do things when it comes to the non-serious Gintama stuff. And the way that I discuss and talk about it. So, that's going to be a lot of fun, man. To bring that side of, of, of the reviewing slash discussion aspect into the channel. But, excuse me, aside from that, man... Go Thomas back this Sunday, bro. Go Thomas back. And I know you guys are excited as I am to finally have that Gintama anime because as much as I love the manga, man, I've, I'm, I'm, I'm anime all day, every day, bro. The Gintama anime is like the heaven sent series that I always waited for and I, it has such a special place in my heart. So whenever I, we see all the, the stuff animated and how much I know the voice actors and the voice actresses really love what they do and how much Sunrise slash Bond and Emco Pictures really love what they do as well, man it's just it's it's so much awesome sauce man i love the anime so much so when it comes back this sunday we'll be in like swimwear to the weekly gintama videos for that it's gonna be a lot of fun that's gonna be a really, really busy day for me but wouldn't have it any other any other way man with the goat tom awesome sauce coming back especially with the content that it's about to cover it's gonna be a lot of fun man really really funny stuff really really emotional stuff and it's it's gonna be, give you those classic goat tama vibes man and it's gonna be awesome sauce, bro. I really can't wait for this Sunday. But I just wanna make this video, you know, talking about the hype and how excited I am for this Sunday, man. Let me know how, how excited you guys are and what you're excited to see and, and are you excited for the, the the change in pace that that that, that we're gonna get here and you know because we've been in serious stuff for twenty eight episodes in the anime. And in the manga we've been in serious stuff for about three years. So it's it's definitely going to be you know a breath of fresh air for us, man, as 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 manga readers and as uh, anime uh, watchers as well. Because since Shogun Assassination, which was at the end of 2015, we have not had an episode like this. So this is going to be really really fun, man. I can't wait to see all this awesome sauce, classic Gotama baby, and it's going to be greatness, man. But I'll see you guys on Sunday, man. Have an awesome sauce of a day. Gotama's back, man. Gotama's back.